Hey guys, so I'm just doing laundry and I wanted to give you a quick update. Um, I figure since I'm so close to my due date, um, I'll do more updates uh, rather than just the weekly updates. I'll probably do daily or every other day depending on if anything happens or how I'm feeling. Um, so yeah, so let me tell you about the rest of yesterday that you guys missed and today. So the rest of yesterday, um, for the rest of the day was pretty normal. Um, I got really tired though and took a nap and for some reason, okay, I have the window open. Um, here it's been raining and cold and really windy, so it's been cold. So I had the window open and I woke up sweating, like sweating from my nap and it was really weird. Um, so yeah, I woke up sweating and then... Uh, I just made dinner, ate dinner, and all throughout the day I was still losing my, like, big pieces of my mucus plug, although it wasn't really, um, there was no more blood in it, it was just regular mucus, so I don't know, but, um, yeah, so that happened, and then, uh, Jaime got home from work, and we laid down, and I started to get sick again, like, like, um, Heartburn, acid reflux sick, which kind of sucks, but, you know, I figured I couldn't escape it forever, forever. Um, but, good news, this morning, um, it's still losing my mucus plug, and this morning I lost the piece that had some blood in it, so that's pretty awesome. Um, oh, yeah, last night I kept waking up with cramps, some period like cramping, not not as strong as when I went to labor. My body went to labor last time. But, um, some mild period like cramps. Very bearable, but mild, but still cramps. And I had them until the morning, and then they kind of went away. And I've been having random period ish like cramps that are very, very, very mild. So I don't know if that is dilation happening or if it just doesn't mean anything. But I'm still losing my mucus plug today, just less than I was yesterday um so I just am losing it here and there little pieces um let's see um I think that's pretty much it for the updates for today I haven't really had that interesting of a day nothing pregnancy related that is super interesting but um or nothing pregnancy related has happened if that makes sense. I just have been uh, playing a lot of Fallout because uh, I think I told you guys for Christmas um, we basically we got each other we got each other the Xbox One so that's our Christmas and I got Fallout 4 so I've been playing it a lot um, and I think I'm actually going to show you guys my belly because I realize I haven't done it in a long time and I'm due in like let's see like eight days and seven hours or well midnight on my due date is eight days and seven hours away away is that right yes so let me show you my belly just in case i never can again um i actually got some stretch marks around my belly button and down here as you can kind of tell these popped up overnight these ones down here and i'm pretty sure that that's after she dropped and you guys can kind of tell that her feet are poking out right here. Because this one is like skinny kind of. This is where her back is and her feet and legs are out here. My skin is really itchy. And you can see right there a little stretch mark. I've been using a lot of lotion and stuff because it's been so itchy. She's actually moving right now. I wonder if you guys can see. No. I have a big old belly now. I was looking back or I was looking back at my 19 week update video um, when I gave you guys a belly shot and I, <laughs> I was so little I actually thought I had a belly baby bump it was funny but yeah so I think that that's pretty much all I have to update you guys on um, Jaime gets paid tomorrow and it's going to be kind of a crappy check because he missed the day yesterday a day last week because of his uh, laser eye surgery 
which, um, good news, he finally got his license back because he got that eye surgery. So, yay, he can take our baby home. I'm excited. Um, but yeah. So anyway, so it's going to be a crappy check, and we're probably not going to buy a lot of groceries or anything. So I hope she, I want her to come this week, but at the same time, I kind of am hoping she waits until next week. Just so we have more money when she gets here, but of course I will be so, so happy if she comes now. Because I am miserable. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys probably tomorrow or in a couple days. We'll see if anything happens, how I feel, you know. Bye.